<laughs> uh, but I understand, however, you are now in a relationship. Oh, Jonathan, what a disaster. Okay, <laughs> so, it's not my fault that I'm dead sexy, is it? <laughs> no, 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 no. I flew home to Canada to film a documentary, and my little sister, you know what she's like, she wanted me to go out drinking with her. I was like, aren't alcoholics supposed to drink alone? She's like, please, come out. So I eventually, I had just landed. I went to the pub with her, and into this pub, walks my first love from when I was 15 years old. I haven't wow. seen him in 20 years. Wow. He walks into the pub. I'm in an old jumper. He looked like a full-blood Hemsworth brother. Just <laughs> hot, <laughs> hot. Nice. And I looked at him and I thought, I'll bang him, won't I? <laughs> so, so how long since you last saw him? I hadn't seen him in 20 years. 20 years, so you instantly recognized him? Of course I did. I'm the one difficult. I have a whole new face, Jonathan. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, I recognized him. He looks the same. I really did like him at the yeah. time. And then um, I took him back to my mom's place, you yeah. know, because Sexy. I don't live yeah. in Canada. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and I know what you're thinking. Just got off a flight, Catherine? Cabin puss. Not concerned for me. Wow. <laughs> Good. Hold on. Good. Let's, let's, let's drill into that a bit. What's <laughs> that? <laughs> Should I, should I even ask what that is? I mean, let me ask, first of all, let me ask this question. Do I want to know what that is? <laughs> Alexander, you seem to know what that is immediately. There was something about the way she said it. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. You've been on a long haul before. Mm. <laughs> but that's how you know it's true love. Yeah. So when we were young... Did you, were, did, you, did you feel like you were in love with him so when you were young? Was that like a love, a relationship where you thought, okay, this could be the real thing? Or did it feel like a fling back then? Oh, no, I was deeply in love with him. Um, we were prom king and queen. Oh, wow. Yas queen. He invested his virginity wisely because <laughs> now I'm a famous celebrity. Hold it, so you were the first woman he sat with? Yeah. Oh, and I love I hope so. It was illegal before we met. <laughs> <laughs> uh, was he the first guy that you slept with? Sure. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> uh, and so you, you met again, and, and so this is going places. You've actually got back together as a couple? Well, I flipped out. I woke up in the morning at my mom's, and I thought, oh, what have I done? You need to leave. I chucked him out. And then um, he came to London, like a real romantic gesture. Oh, he followed you here. I, it's awful, isn't it? What a disaster. So, I mean, it's under review at yeah, the moment, okay. is the best I can say. Why, why disaster, though? Because you do so much material about the joys of being a single mom, is that it? Well, yeah, I had really designed my life. My daughter and I have a shape of a family that's controversial, and I don't want to abandon those women. Yeah. I really do think that I like being by myself. For so long, women were not allowed to buy a house, open a bank account, or carry a passport without the signature of a man. You know, and here I've fallen in love with one. Yeah. I mean, no, I begged him at my mom's house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I mean, no, I kind of, I like him, but now we have to worry about hiding from my daughter. Well, so. yeah, I was going to ask, because your daughter, Violet, we've spoken about the change. She's like a smart young woman. She's, she seems funny to me. She seems funny. What does she make of this change in this rather wonderful mother-daughter unit yeah. that was self-sufficient, and suddenly this, this hairy guy, I'm assuming hairy, this No, guy. He's, he's hairless like a dolphin. Wow. <laughs> he's so sweet as well. Yeah. But my daughter, Violet, really likes our arrangement. So when he came and stayed with us for a while, he was in the spare room, she was in the master bedroom, doing the whole, what do you call this time? She yeah. didn't want us dating, so we'll see. He's under review. But she's so cute, and he is called Bobby, so she has to say his name. We can't say his name in this country. Every time we go, we say, oh, he's called Bobby, Bobby. British people think it's Barbie, like the doll. Yeah. So she steps in and she's like, oh, they're Canadian, they're trying to say Bobby. He's, like, Bobby. he's my mommy's boyfriend from when she was very small. And right now he's only visiting, he's under review. Yeah. So. Is, that, is that really her accent? Is that really how she sounds? Well, yeah, that's where I learned it. That's how she talks. Wow. Yeah. I thought she was just mocking them when she started it. But she, <laughs> she was born here, she stitches you up. You know, we'll go visiting and she'll say, um, my Mummy hides wine in the walls. It's a wine rack. I'm not hiding it there. She calls white wine day wine and okay. red wine night wine. Yeah. <laughs> She's got that right. Yeah. She's not wrong. Yeah. So. We have a picture. We had the picture which uh, <laughs> Catherine put on her Instagram account. This is you. Yeah. There you are back in the day on the left. So. That was just when I was young and he was young and then we were grown up. That's 20 years between those photos. Wow, that's amazing. I did ask him if I could talk about him before I came out or else, you know, his, when his wife finds out, she's going to be mad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, hopefully this will solve that minor speed bump in the way there.